What's going on YouTube? Today's video, we're gonna do a review on this new Horo Jump Brake Tip. I wanna thank Nelson, the maker and founder of Hero Tips for sending me this tip for me to test out. As you can see, this is how the tip looks. It has a goldish tint to it. And this is a jump brake tip. Let's go ahead and measure this out. As you can see, this is on millimeters and it's just above 15 millimeters. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, I'm gonna install it into my um, jump brake cue. This is an action jump brake cue, as you can see. And this is the tip. Let's go ahead. This is a G10, um, a G10 tip ferrule combined. And this measures out to 13, just a little bit, just exactly on 13. And that gives me about two millimeter, uh, mil, millimeters to play with. So, but before we go ahead and install this, we're gonna go ahead and do some comparisons breaking with this, with this, with the G10 on a eight ball, nine ball, and 10 ball break. And then we're gonna install this and then compare it how it looks. I'm gonna be installing the Hero tip on my uh, Mid American Culey, as you can see. This is gonna be my setup. And when I spoke to Nelson, he said this tip cuts just like a Tom's tip, so it should be easy to be installed, and I should have no issues cutting this. Well, as you can see, this is how the tip looks. I made it a little bit shorter so that it's easier to manage to work with. It's not so long. And let's go ahead and test this out on um, eight ball, nine ball, and 10 ball break. 
And I forgot to do some jump shots, so we're gonna go ahead and do some jump shots with this tip also. I scuffed the tip with my um, scuffer, and let's go ahead and look at how it chalks. I just noticed it holds the chalk pretty well, especially for a jump break. It's a lot easier than the G10. So hopefully we'll be able to control the cue ball with this also. So let's go ahead and test out the jump shot. So I got this about a the object ball about a diamond apart from the cue ball. And we'll go ahead and try to just make it in the corner pocket. Not bad. Now let's go ahead and test out the dart stroke. This is about a ball's width apart. Just jump over to one and make it into the side. I'm very impressed with this Hodo jump break tip. It cuts a lot easier than the G10, but for some reason it hits just like a G10. But the thing is it controls the cue ball a lot easier and it holds the chalk way better than the G10. So it compares the hardness, like the way it hits is like a G10, which, is I, like, which I like a lot, but it cuts very easy and it's easy to install. Hopefully this video was informative. Thank you for watching. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, and also leave a comment down below. Thank you for watching, and see you next time. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe me. Don't forget the thumbs up. Bye bye. I want to thank Nelson, the founder and maker of Hero Tips, for setting me some examples. Back.